Changing Ooh. gears now to my other Roll. favorite topic. Roll this hands. is nice. <laughs> I'm thinking we had a lot of right. I learned we, this in Hawaii. We were hoping to spend the holiday weekend in Hawaii, but we can't be there, so we decided to bring Hawaii to the Good kitchen, on. complete with hula dancers, <laughs> uh, making pulled pork sandwiches. This looks amazing, with pineapple Al. Pineapple salsa. I've already been picking at it. And it's we've delicious. even got some so grilled good. spam, because spam is very. I've never had spam. I've never had spam. Spam is very big in Hawaii, and they even do spam sushi. But we're going to start by making pulled pork. We start off with a, a pork butt. A big old a butt. A big old a butt. Rump. That's a rump. <laughs> That's right. And this is all the stuff for the marinade, for your sauce, whatever you're going to do. This is That's what you're going to get started with, okay? Mm. First, you're going to make a little marinade. We've got some uh, uh, apple cider vinegar, mm. some ketchup, a little Tabasco. All right, we've got that together. We've also got brown sugar, some cumin, some pepper, some salt, uh, some chili powder. You're going to mix that all together. That's going to be it's part of your sauce and part of your mm. marinade. How long right. do you let that sit you just in, let, on you, the pork? As soon as you do it, you, well, yeah. first things first, you got that. Okay. Now you want to rub your butt. Ooh. I've been Ow. waiting all day Come just on. to say that. Come on! <laughs> Come on, seriously? Really? Come on. Okay, so. You do a dry rub then. A nice dry rub. Dry rub. Uh, you, can, you can make your own, or you, I like mm -hmm. this, this company's, uh, and I don't get anything out of it, it's called Hasty Bake, uh, mm -hmm. and they make a great mm -hmm. grill, but they also make a great rub. You can also slice your, your pork here in the middle. Okay, so slice you, the butt. That's right. Slice your butt. You put that right <laughs> there in the butt crack. The crack. Yes, the okay. butt crack right in there. Okay. <laughs> Dylan Dreyer started that. Okay. Okay. Now you're going to basically put this in into a, a deep dish, oven-proof skill uh, bowl. That's a big mm -hmm. pot. Uh, like for a Dutch about oven. five minutes on each side. You just want to brown it up. Okay. <laughs> then once you get it nice and brown over here, you're going to take some of your <laughs> marinade. <laughs> And she said Dutch take, oven. It's a Dutch oven, that's right. <laughs> you're going to put that in there. You're going to pour in some of the marinade. You're going to cover it. We're being silly. Okay. And you're going to put it in the oven at about 325 for about three hours. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Once it comes out, okay, let's just pretend I washed my hands, okay? I don't want to hear from people. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so... This, it comes out looking like this. You want to put it back in the oven for about 20 minutes or so mm -hmm. at a high heat on a to rack? crisp it up. On a rack, okay, okay. crisping it up, Ooh. uncovered, so you get this. Now, you let it cool for a little bit because this meat's going to stay hot for a while. Mm. And you're basically going to shred your pork. And oh, look wow. at this. Oh, oh, and I like hard. to include the outside parts, too, oh, when you chop it up. That's the best because part, Because right? it is. So it, you just keep shredding. You'll shred it. You'll mm. take some of this fantastic marinade. You'll pour mm. that so in. So that together. was left over, not that what was, it was left over. In. No, you don't want it to, because no, no, it'll, no. it'll have evaporated by that mm. point anyway. So you've got that together. Now, let it soak a pineapple a salsa. Mm. You're going to take some onions, some cilantro, some jalapeno, pour that into this chopped uh, pineapple. You're also going to take a little salt, some lemon, uh, some lime uh, zest. You're going to mix that I all love together. I pineapple salsa. That's so good. And you can add, I, I sometimes add tomatillas to it. It's, yeah. it's really terrific. And now you make your sandwich, uh, all right? You take and on your, the sweet potato rolls are just sweet, so This yummy. is a potato, a potato roll. If you could find yeah. a uh, King's Hawaiian roll, oh, man, yeah. that would be fantastic, too. a little sweeter, too. right? A little sweeter. Mm -hmm. You put it all together. You got this up, mm. and there oh, you have it. this is delicious. And this feeds a bunch of people, too. Which I'm is telling great. you, it's mm. great. And it's great. And, and it makes good leftovers. And you just, and grill, you just it? grill it on the, on the grill. A little more salsa. Mm -hmm. Hey, before we go, we want to mention mm. a Today Food Club member standout. Shay Goldstein from Helena, Helena mm -hmm. Alabama, made a white cheddar and pineapple stuffed chorizo burger. Get the recipe and mine. Go to today.com slash food. Come on, Al. That's Join right. us. Let's hula out of here. <laughs> it's Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.